officer was in the process of responding to a call when he witnessed an unrelated woman screaming profanities at a man before throwing a mostly full soda can at him. Hey, yo. That's assault, by the way. Hey. Hi there. I'm Officer Shoulder, Sash Guys, please. What's going on? Are you guys coming from the corner on the house on the corner or what? Okay, yeah. what's going on? I'm from Solutions. Don't believe that word. He says he's psychotic. Look at this okay. Oompa Loompa. Where, well, where are you coming from? Uh, Solutions. No, I didn't get called. Poor idea. It sounds like this is just an unrelated disturbance. Do you need to talk to me about anything or are you okay? I'm worried about her. She's not ready to be clean and I she's see. going to. Mm -hmm. okay. Are you guys are going to Solutions though? I was. I have an appointment and she says she's not ready. Okay. Baby! Is there anything the fact that, that he got blurred out. I know she about to get arrested bad. <laughs> well, she did, yeah. Uh, they blurred her mouth. She getting arrested bad. Hey, sir. Real quick. Sir. Sir. Real quick. Is there anything I can help you guys with? Otherwise, I'm on another call right now. Okay. You're good? Too hot for some people. Did he pick up the littering? Yeah. I wouldn't have thrown it in my, in my car, though. That's the government's vehicle. That's not my car. <laughs> That's what he said. Can you just start me a separate disturbance involving these two? Right. He's like, what the fuck is this? I keep hearing him shouting. I'll be out on Parkway in Monroe. She's hitting and pushing him. Yes. Get him. Get him. Hey! Get back here! Who are you to her? I'm her to the other. Oh, you're not! Oh, you're not! We were shut together. Will you stop? No! Ma'am, stop walking. You stop. You're detained, shorty. What? I'll just take one more. Cuffs. You can't be hitting and pushing him. Please leave me alone, man. I'm okay. Okay, stop walking oh, and talk to me. You threatened the police? It's too late for that because you're already causing a disturbance in the in public. Okay, do you guys live together? Yes! Done for. Okay. That's a domestic. Leave me alone! So stop walking. That's stop a domestic, walking. shorty. Stop walking. <laughs> stop it. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Your hands behind your back. What am I under arrest for? Battery. For not listening, for one. <laughs> See, I don't get this, right? When the po the police can't just grab you up off the street, right? They can't stop you. You have, a, you have a right to remain silent. You don't have to talk to them at all, right? But if they have a reason to believe, reasonable suspicion, that you committed a crime, they have articulable, reasonable suspicion that you committed a crime, right? Here, he don't even have articulable, reasonable suspicion. He has probable cause. He saw you strike the boy. That's all he needs to take you to jail. But I don't think he was going to do that right away. But he at least exercised his right to, to Terry stop you, to, to, to detain you. When the police detain you, although that's when people start asking, am I, am I free to leave, right? No, you're not free to leave mm -hmm. because you're being detained. So if you try to escape while they're trying to detain you, you don't give them your ID, you're... Yeah, resisting all that. You can get charged with resisting because they're trying to legally detain you and you're fucking escaping. Mm -hmm. that, that, and the problem is that people don't realize this is that a lot of times they don't have probable cause to arrest you until you start acting like a nut and try to escape. They're like, well, now we got you just on resisting because because we're trying to detain you legally and you're not allowing us to. Mm -hmm. Then we'll do some other shit and see what else you actually did. But... Got to do better than that. I mean, I don't really think he was going to do all this initially. I think he was going to stop her and be like, why did you hit this guy? What's wrong with you? Yeah. Give me my phone then! I am going to not eat and drink in the gym and I will f***ing take a big red f***ing Just relax. What's your name? I'm not telling you shit! 480, mark female 95. Hog 
Is she? She's spitting again. So She's gonna get the bag. I was on the corner. Yeah. One. We had go yeah. I, yeah. I, see, we watched enough of these to know. Keep fucking with the police, bro. Keep spitting on them, hitting them. Do they gonna tie your legs? They gonna put a, put a bag over your head, like, bro? It could get bad out here, son. Nah, all... <laughs> you, you're literally spitting bodily fluids at me. I don't know what you have. Yeah, I don't. That, I don't. That is definitely. Yeah, a I don't want hepatitis twelve <laughs> or whatever you got. Like, I don't want that. <laughs> like, hey, dirty ass. I don't want that. She. This is a meth addict. She. This is a needle user. Don't don't touch me. For real, bro. He said she don't want to get clean. There's only a few things that you need to get clean from that be having you nutting out like this, bro. <laughs> like, what are we talking about? Going on. And then these two are yelling at each other. She's throwing soda at him, screaming at him. So I let him go down the street because he separates from her for a while. So he keeps following her. She keeps screaming. I look back. She's punching him, slapping him, pushing him. So I try to stop her. And she ran off. When you got here. Yeah. So. <laughs> Hey! Shit is slow. Oh, that's a rip. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, you are. Well, you need to get up off the ground, and you can sit in the air-conditioned car, and we can talk about what happened. No, I don't. I'm not leaving. No. Yes, you can. Man, you only have one or two options. Like, you only have one or two options. Right. You either want to have the good option or the bad option. Right. So which one is it? You can sit up and talk to us, and maybe we can hear something. That maybe will let us have us let you out of these cuffs. Right, and make it easier on yourself. Or, or we, we can, can just take you to jail right now. Right. Because you're wilding right now on the detainment. And I seen you hit a, a, a innocent bystander, innocent citizen. And like, 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 let's be for real. You're in no position to tell anybody <laughs> what you're going to be doing. Right. Bitch. I'm going to leave. No, you're not. How? Look at you. <laughs> Look at you. you what position are you doing? Like, Adrian, Adrian, Adrian. If, if... <laughs> If he if he took the handcuffs off and just stood there and said, "All right, run for it," <laughs> <laughs> how far do you think she'd get? <laughs> how far do you think she'd get, bro? Get out of here! You are five hundred pounds. <laughs> them knees, the way she was walking, like she was fight. Them knees are not good. That's bone on bone. I can tell us by looking at arthritic. There's no way she's running. There's <laughs> no chance she's running, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna leave to go where, bro. Shut up. <laughs> damn, you had a bad ankle. Yeah, everything on your leg bad. We know you damn need it. You probably look like you need a hip replacement already. Stop. No. That's why we're trying to sit you up. Tell you to stop yelling and spitting at us and screaming at us. We can't help you. Stop taking the cuffs off. Stop. We can't take the cuffs off because of how you're acting. Oh, what? We can't let you leave. You just said you were going to yourself. I just said that so I could go to the psych ward. Okay, so you're not. Yeah. I am if I go to jail. No, I get that. So you want to go to the psych ward? I don't need to go back to jail. <laughs> Do you guys live together or what? Yeah. Yes, and he's my ex because I'm going to not care anymore and do what I want. Maybe stop. Stop. You're the fucking reason I'm in cuffs. Because you weren't listening to me and I'm following me. Because I know what you were going to do. I wasn't going to do shit. I have the messages. If she doesn't want to get up right now, just hang out with her. I'm going to talk to him real quick and just Oh, so she really on. is. What's happening? Yeah. Obviously, okay. like, initially, I was just going to let you guys go. You try to see. She's, like that. She's, she's following her to stop her. That's why. She starts hitting you. So I'm not going to have that. Coming down. We are a week clean. She's we. Okay, what's her name? Usually it is the Jennifer. case that they yeah. together. You're going to Solutions, then what? She went to the bathroom, messaged an active user. I asked her what she... I see. She uh -huh. said she was going to stay there with me. She's going to go get drugs. To show He's like, support nope. for me. Because <clears throat> I want to be clean. She's just got a lot of mental problems that yeah. she beats herself up over. Okay. And I worry about her. She should mm -hmm. go to a inpatient like... Well, she's probably going to jail today. For resisting and she yeah. spit on that officer yeah. probably domestic because she was hitting you and you guys lived together mm -hmm. so she's gonna get charged so that would be yeah, first probably. what you mean um given the fact that <coughs> she did state that she was gonna off herself in front of the police mm -hmm. that still wouldn't supersede her going to the psych ward rather than jail i don't know there, there's probably different criteria in every state, but I, but I, I would think maybe for them to take her to the psych ward instead of jail, mm -hmm. she'd have to do more than what we've seen. Okay, okay. Or say, or do more what we've seen, because just, just saying I'm going to kill myself doesn't mean that 
that they're gonna immediately right. take you to the psych ward instead jail. of the, instead yeah. of jail, yeah. right? They <laughs> they might even now what they might do is take you to jail and put you on suicide watch or something. Mm-hmm. Take, take take you to the um to holding or whatever and have people mm-hmm. watch you mm-hmm. or keep you tied up because because when they take you to holding they, let, they, they uncuff you, mm-hmm. but if you are a danger to yourself they might leave you cuffed yeah. or cuff you to something yeah. right they have shit in there to like fucking tie you up yeah if they, yeah if they have to I so, haven't seen one of those in years but a long time <laughs> maybe they don't use those anymore I don't know what they use but they but they have something that they could use beyond handcuffs to tie you up mm-hmm. to prevent you from hurting yourself until. They can call the 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 white lab codes. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So I don't know, but I feel like you'd have to do a little bit more than what she did to actually get go get to go there. there because they'd be like, "Hey man, shut up! You resisted. Get in this jail cell." That's true. Everybody I mean, the way that that. she's acting is completely unacceptable. I understand she's going through a lot, but that's her throwing sodas at you, yelling and screaming the whole way down the street, Spitting. turning out and hitting you, and you're trying to calm her down. Like we can't be having that. Spit on and the then police. She resists, and then she spits on us. Yeah. She was trying to spit on. Me. Well, well the, no. oh. right. What a nice guy, right? Right. What a nice he, guy. No, he understands that she's going through something, but it sucks that she has to go through this first right. because of what she deals how, how, with. How nice is he? He's like, nah, it was me. But she spit on him first. When she was hitting you over there, was that causing you pain? I'm used to it. Well, that doesn't answer my question. <laughs> right. No. That doesn't answer his question. Yeah, and he's trying to determine what to charge her with. Yeah. Because... Some states, the, the 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 linchpin that turns fucking um, battery into assault is whether you felt pain hmm. or whether you experienced pain. I never knew that. Thank you. Right? Because battery is just an unwanted touching. Okay. So if I lay my hand on your shoulder against your will, technically that's a battery. Hmm. Right? You say, don't touch me. And I'm like, like that, that's a battery. Right? But I squeeze your arm. That's a battery. Right? But did I hurt you? Did I cause you pain? That's not the same thing as a slap or a punch or a... Uh, p- push or something mm-hmm. you feel me so a lot of times he's like did it hurt you or was it just like bodily contact that happened you know what i mean because if someone just like you know like that doesn't that that's not an assault that's a battery because you just let you let our bodies collide intentionally mm-hmm. right okay. but then there's you know something with force behind it or you know some type of open hand slap something that stings feels pain anything like that then they might have grounds to charge you with more than battery and assault instead Okay. I really don't want her to go to jail. I understand, but there's only so many things that we can turn a blind eye to, right? Please don't let her go to jail. There's nothing you can do, bro. Yeah. You spit on the police, now you go to jail. You bucking out. <laughs> yeah, it is. Better than outside, though. Let's see what she got. Let's, let's see what charges she got, because I know they charge her with all type of shit. They had to look. Just have a seat on the bench to your right. Jennifer was charged with two counts of disorderly conduct. Yep. One count with a domestic abuse modifier. Yep. Resisting or obstructing an officer and yep. misdemeanor bail jumping. What? She was found guilty on both counts of disorderly conduct and sentenced to 41 days in local jail as well as 12 months of we probation. Get to bail jumping? Bail jumping? Yeah, we get there. Bail jumping? <laughs> what? Man, she must have had a prior case or something. Yeah. And then she went there and was like, yeah, and by the way, we're tacking this on because your dumbass didn't come to court last time. Well, she's trying to recover. And sometimes <laughs> if you're trying to recover, you might relapse. I know, but goddamn, you miss things that you weren't, you're you supposed to have appointments for and everything yeah, else. Right, and that's why the police come to, come, come to grab you up. Yep. The fuck? <laughs> it's outrageous behavior. Bro did everything he could to prevent uh-huh. her behavior from taking her to jail. And she, she's like, nah, I'd rather go to prison. Ridiculous. 